Hi guys, today we'll be talking about multiplying radicals. Let's get started. As always, please pause and try the examples. So let's go through the first one. In this one, the root 3 that's out in front will get multiplied. And the rule is to basically multiply the numbers inside of the square root. And then, so we'll get root 6 and then plus 5 root 3 for this one. So it's basically that 5 will be on the outside and the root 3 will be there. Try the next one. So in this one, we will get 3 root 48. And we know that 48 from before can be divided and simplified. And we are looking for groups of 2. So we would have a 4 come on the outside, so 2 times 2. We were able to form a group of 2 and another group of 2. So 2 times 2 on the outside, so 4. And then we have 3 left inside of the bracket. So this would be 12 root 3 plus 12 root 18. And 18 can also be broken down into 2, 9, 3, 3, which is basically going to be plus uh, 12 times 3 root 18, which would be 36 root 18. Good. Or sorry, not 18. 2. So we were able to bring one of the 3s out, but one of the twos remains, so the two would stay here. Two, two. So yeah, initially we did six times three, which was the 18, and then we simplified the 18 down to get that. Okay, try doing these examples. So in this one, remember to foil it properly. So we would get Square root of 9 for the first one. Root 3 times 4 would be 4 root 3. And then 2 times root 3 would be 2 root 3 plus 8. Combine like terms. And we will get... So square root of 9 is 3. These ones have the same base. So we can add them. So it would be like plus 6 root 3 plus 8, and then we can combine the 8 to become 11 plus 6 root 3. Okay, try the next one. So very similar, 3 root 2 plus 2 root 6 gets multiplied by itself. So 3 root 2 plus 2 root 6. So to do this, you would do the foiling, don't just distribute this in, that is incorrect. And I see it done all the time. So now you would get 9 root 4 plus 6 root 12 plus 6 root 12 plus 4 root 36. And then that's just going to be 18. And then um, this one, the 12s, we can combine to be 12 root 12, and then root of 36 is 6 times 4 would be 24. So we would get 42 plus uh, root 12, we can simplify. So we can take out a 2, so it would become 24 root 3. Okay, and try this one. It's very similar. This is the same thing as 2x minus root y multiplied by 2 root x minus root y. So when we do this, we will get 4 root x squared minus 2 at root x y minus 2 root 
x, y plus y squared. And then just simplifying that, we will get 4x plus y from here. And then minus 4 root x, y. Perfect.